Ever wondered how a craniotomy is actually done? In simple terms, it's a very precise, carefully planned procedure where doctors temporarily remove a small part of the skull to access the brain. But it's much gentler than it sounds. The surgery starts with the medical team using advanced imaging to figure out the safest path, marking a small area on the scalp, kind of like drawing a map for the head. After the patient is fully asleep under general anesthesia, the surgeon carefully makes an incision in the skin and uses specialized tools to remove a small piece of bone, like creating a little door, rather than drilling straight into the skull. Once the brain is exposed, doctors can treat issues like tumors, bleeding, or pressure, all while monitoring brain function to protect crucial areas. Once the treatment is done, the bone is carefully placed back and secured, allowing it to heal properly. Finally, the skin is stitched up, and the patient enters the recovery phase, where doctors continue to monitor the healing process to ensure everything goes smoothly.